Every time I've played this guitar in public, I get comments from people surprised at how good it sounds. They say, Dude, that guitar sounds great. For some reason, they can't believe an ovation would sound this good. I'm not sure why this is such a common sentiment. In my experience, ovations have always had a pleasant sound. The Ovation Balladeer the Ovation Balladeer is an acoustic electric guitar, and I like it. It has Ovation signature round back design that sets it apart from traditional flat backed acoustic guitars. It has a rich sound with warm low tones and clear high tones. You might expect the round back design to negatively impact the sound, but the shape is the key to the full tone. Ovation Guitars was founded in the 1960s by Charles Command, a guitar aficionado and aerospace engineer. The company was established with the aim of creating a new kind of acoustic guitar that would offer improved sound quality using aerospace materials. Fancy! After months of research, the big-brained engineers concluded that the most efficient shape for the guitar back was a semi-parabolic shape, similar to an orchestra hall or radar reflector. This shape produced a fuller sound than other shapes in testing. After deciding on the shape, they had to come up with a material to use. It would be difficult to form wood into the proper shape, and the nature of acoustics were required to be thin, which would make wood too flimsy to be practical. Eventually, the engineers developed a material called Lyricord. Lyricord is similar to carbon fiber, making it extremely durable and it can be formed into any shape while still being thin enough for adequate acoustic resonance. The internal pickup and preamp are powered by a 9-volt battery. It has EQ controls with adjustments for bass, mid, and treble frequencies, so you can fine-tune the sound to your liking. When I was a young man, I was very skinny. And most acoustic guitars were very uncomfortable to hold. They would dig into my bony ribs with their sharp edges. But with its round back design, that's not a problem with the ovation. The trade off for this elevated level of comfort is that the round back has a tendency to slide down the leg while sitting. A small price to pay for comfort. The playability of this guitar is fantastic. Acoustic guitars typically have higher action than electrics, but the action of the Balladeer is comparable to many electric guitars. The tuning hardware is smooth and reliable. Additionally, the tuning ratio is subtle enough to allow for accurate fine-tuning, and once in tune, it stays there. complaints about the headstock design, but not for any practical reason. People just think it looks weird. Personally, I like the way it looks. I've played many acoustics in my time. Epiphones, Martins, Taylors. And out of all the acoustics I've played, this Ovation is my favorite. It's comfortable to hold, the action makes it easy to play, and it sounds fantastic. 
Whether it's plugged in or not, it just sounds good. It's difficult to adequately articulate acoustic resonance with words. And I'm sure your phone speakers, headphones, or whatever device you're watching this on, combined with YouTube's compression, aren't doing this sound any favors. The Ovation Balladeer. It's a versatile, high quality acoustic electric, I'm sorry, electric acoustic guitar that offers a unique sound and exquisite playability. I'm quite fond of this guitar. I usually avoid giving fanboy level recommendations on this channel as everyone has different tastes and needs. But with this ovation, I can't recommend it enough. Anyway, that's about all I got for this one. Thanks for watching, good luck on all the things, and I'll see you later.